What up, what up, what up, people? It's your boy Marv Lat, and this is The Nerds in the Hood. I don't even know why I looked up. I was trying to be cool there. <laughs> anyway, uh, back again. The folks, I have been blessed with a lot of exciting news that you're going to see in just a moment. Uh, just got home from work about an hour ago, ate my dinner. I was like, all right, I'm about to record a video. But everybody in their mom has been telling me already, like, yo, have you seen this trailer for Sign to Hitchhawk 3? I was like, nah, I was at work. They were like, fam, you need to see it. Go see it now. So I made sure, got my Sonic the Hitchhawk shirt on. I said, we got ourselves a trailer to watch and react to real quick, try to dissect it real quick, see what's going on in the game. And this is another edition we call Trailer Gang. You saw we did this a little while back when we first started the show, uh, the reboot, but now we're doing it again because there's some heat out and we need to check it out. It's been a little while since we did this. So here we go. We're going to do it again. So what we're going to do is uh, we're going to see what it's giving. It's either giving excitement, it's either giving anticipation, or it's giving flop. And we're going to find that out right now. So this is the latest trailer for Sonic the Hitchhawk 3. Let's talk about it because we already know the big things is coming. So let's check it out. Here we go. Sonic, you finally found your family. Keep up. Oh, snap. Sonic Heroes. But you didn't change who you are in here. Squad, squad. In my lungs. Pull <laughs> your heart. <laughs> been a high level security breach. Oh. And we need Team Sonic's immediate assistance. Team Sonic, just like Sonic Heroes. Far beyond anything we've ever encountered. Wow, look at this fur. Shadow's story began a lot like your Sonic. But where you found family and friends, Shadow found only pain and loss. Mm. Alright, we got a rogue alien on the loose. How do we find it? Start with a giant fireball. I love it. Let's start with a giant fireball. Hmm. He's much more impressive than the hedgehog I pulled previously. Dude, I'm standing right here. <laughs> You're a colorful bunch. We don't want to bite you. Actually, Sonic, I would like to bite. <laughs> oh, snap. Whew. Hold that. Oh. Oh! He's too powerful. Yo! I can't believe I'm saying this, but we need you know who. Oh, snap. When is that ever stopping? Calling the legend back. The fat suit! He got a fat suit. Visitors, this is sad, Robotnik. Even for you. We need your help on one condition. <laughs> yes. Do this. If I can't rule the world, here we go. Save it. I need room, sir. I don't have the proper materials. Find something. <laughs> The motorcycle, let's go. What did you do? What I had to. A cure slot. <laughs> Welcome home, my boy. What? It's impossible. Is it? We couldn't. We couldn't it find Are you? In the saggy flesh. Oh my gosh, no way did we just do two Jim Carries. Now it is giving anticipation. I am sold on this, ladies and gentlemen. First off, if you heard in the trailer, you can hear it. That means they're going to be doing Live and Learn, which is the opening, if I'm right, the opening or the main theme from Sonic Adventure 2. It was the main theme and Sonic Adventure 2, which was Sonic and the introduction to Shadow the Hedgehog. Um, 
Live and learn. Sorry. Had to get that out of my system. Um, it's, it's giving nostalgia. It's giving anticipation. I'm hype right now. Um, just seeing this and knowing that Sonic the Hitchhog 1 worked. Sonic the Hitchhog 2 worked. Bringing in Knuckles. Knuckles, the TV show, somehow made it work. And now we have Keanu Reeves being Shadow. So that means if there is an Amy Hedgehog, if there is a Rose Bat, if we do um, the fish, uh, the cat big, or the a kid, uh, what was the little babies that they had to take care of? I'm, I'm, my mind is racing right now. If we do the alligator, the bees, anybody, if we do any of these people, that means they all have to have uh, famous guest voices. I know they're not as big as Shadow the Hedgehog, and I don't think we're going to get to Silver the Hedgehog, but if we do, it, we got to keep going this route. You gave us Idris Elba, you gave us um, Keanu Reeves. So the next several people, if we go that route, has to be there. But um, I like what I see here. This it, it doesn't look like this movie is going to slow down or take a step back from what the second one was able to achieve. And in the first in the second one, we had Super Sonic, where he turned uh, basically like I like to call it Super Saiyan Sonic. So maybe we'll get Silver Shadow. I don't know. But at least for this movie, they're making Shadow out to be a very powerful hedgehog. And Sonic is going to have to find some way out of this. Um, I didn't think he'd be working with Robotnik, but whatever. But this is the best way to keep Jim Carrey in the films. Because Sean, Sonic and Robotnik don't often work together. I don't can't really say I can recall the time. But I could be wrong. Maybe in one of the TV shows or something. But it's not often. But... Um, that's the way you had to keep Jim Carrey in the film, then I'm all for it because Jim Carrey is a wonderful addition to this movie. Um, he was a legend. We all know this. We've seen what he can do in even bad films. So I like where this is going. And uh, as always, the regular cast of people are already there, um, including Tika Sumter, James Martin, all that stuff. But yeah, we I heard Jessica Jones is going to be in this, uh, Christian Ritter. But I, I like what I see. This is a fire. I see why people was linking me like, bro, how did you not do a video on this yet? My bad. My bad. Brother had to work. And you know, his podcast ain't paying the bills yet. So oh, I can't wait till December. Sonic is doing his thing this this year. You know, he has a, he has a, a video game coming out that is also going to have Son uh, Shadow the Hedgehog. Um, was it Sonic Superstars or whatever that's going to be coming out and like I said the Knuckles TV show earlier this year didn't do as bad as many people had thought um, it was actually it was goofy but we knew it was going to be goofy but it was it was a fun kind of goofy even the scene where him and like Wade's mom was just beating up bad guys in the kitchen and the camera was spinning around um, that was fun it was it was fun it was a fun six episodes if anybody thought it was going to be anything better than what they saw you're wilding for respect. That's on you. So anyway, um, yeah, I got to say this got my attention. It's got my eye. Um, it's given anticipation. It's not given flop. I cannot wait till December. The year is going to end off right. And we need this movie to be fire because Borderlands kind of hurt us a little bit with the video game adaptations. Borderland hurt the streak that we was on for a little while. After Mortal Kombat stunk up the place, the next several movies, including Sonic the Hitchhog 2, was on point. And then Last of Us, Twisted Metal, Fallout, all the other ones that came in between, The Witcher, all that. So we need this to erase the stench that is Borderlands and come through with the fire that is Sonic the Hitchhog 3. Um, I even got to see the poster that they had, and the poster even looks fire. It's like Shadow and Sonic running towards each other, and they're both making the number three with their colors. Fuego fam. This marketing already is off the rip and the movie just had the trailer today. So looking forward to another trailer. Looking forward to seeing this movie when it hits. And if we if they do do another trailer that might show more, I'll we'll watch that again too. But in the meantime, in between time, we're gonna wrap it there. Make sure you follow us on all social media. Our link tree uh, will be in the description so that way you can be in the know as to everything nerds in the hood. Your boy Marv Lat. I'm gonna catch y'all next time. This Sonic Hitchcock trailer is lit. I'll holla at y'all. Peace.